Hi guys, Miss Amanda here. Um, today I am actually going to do story time with you guys and I'm really excited to read this book because I know some of you guys love dinosaurs and I do too. So I wanted to pick a book that is super duper fun and that I enjoy and I hope that you guys would enjoy too. Um, but before we get started, I need everybody to go find a spot on their floor or on their couch or maybe on their beds, wherever you feel comfortable at, um, to read the story. And then next, I'm also going to need you guys to turn on your listening ears, okay, so we can read the story, okay? So like I said, um... I'm going to read a book that um, I think you guys would enjoy, and it's called Digger the Dinosaur. Pretty excited about it. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay. Digger the Dinosaur. Digger was a good dinosaur, but he was a busy dinosaur. Sometimes he forgot to listen. Digger, Mama Sawyer called. Clean your room. Does your mom and dad ask you guys to clean your room? Yeah, mine did too while, when I was growing up. Digger looked at Stego. Stego looked at Digger. Can't I play? Digger asked. No, said Mama Sawyer. Your room is a mess. She said yes, asked Digger. She said mess, said Stego. I can fix that, said Digger. I will help, said Stego. Let's go, said Digger. Put your coat on the hook, said Stego. So Digger did. Digger, said Stego. You put your coat on a book. Uh-oh. You said book, said Digger. I said hook, said Stego. Do you guys hang your jackets up at home? You do? Where do you guys hang your jackets up? Very cool. I hang mine up in my closet or I hang my jackets up in a closet next to my front door so I don't forget them when I go to work. I can fix that, said Digger, and he did. Let's put these bones away, said Stego. So Digger did, and Stego did too. You guys don't put bones away, do you? Hmm. Digger, said Stego. You put the stones away. You said stones, said Digger. I said bones, said Stego. I can fix that, said Digger. And he did. Mama Sore walked in. Put those hats away, she said, and then go play. Hurry, said Digger, and he did. And Stego did too. Wait, said Digger. Did she say hats? Stego nodded. I think so. What animal makes the meow sound, guys? Yeah, a cat. Digger and Stego roared. We both got mixed up, said Stego. Mama Sore walks in. Good job, she said. No more mess. Oh my goodness, look guys, they ended up putting their cats in the closet. That's so silly. She said, yes, said Digger. Let's play ball. And they did. Can anybody tell me what sport involves a ball and a baseball bat? Yeah, baseball. Looks like they're going to go outside and play baseball. Oh my gosh, that looks like so much fun. The end. Well, thanks guys for checking in and reading Digger the Dinosaur with me. I hope you guys really enjoyed the book. And if you guys are ever in the clinic and want to read it with your teachers, you can always ask your teacher to find the book. All right. Well, thanks for reading with me, guys. I hope you guys have a great evening. Bye.